a recent issue I just ran into with my Android phone is when the battery is let run completely dead, if you go to plug it in at night and expect your alarm to go off the next morning, um, it will not do so unless you turn the phone on physically after you have already um, plugged it in to charge it. What seems like should happen is you plug it in and it eventually would boot up after the battery is somewhat charged. Um, thankfully there is a simple fix for this. You need a file manager of some kind and you also need a rooted phone. So you're going to click up here where it says home page and you're going to go to device. Now we're going to scroll down until we find system. Right here, system. Then we're going to go into bin and now scroll down through here until you find the file that's named LPM. Oh, overshot it. Right there. LPM. Now this we're going to rename to LPM.old. It'll rename. There it is. Now we can create a new file that we will name LPM. Oops. Okay, LPM. So now that's been created. Now we're going to want to tap on that, hit open as text, and we're going to want to open it with ES Note Editor. Click the edit button up here, and then type in like this. I'm going to do pound exclamation mark slash system slash bin slash sh and we're going to do 20 sleep 20 and then slash system slash bin slash reboot now what we're doing here I'll explain this in case you're curious this defines that it is a shell script. Sleep 20 is the next line. Uh, what that does is when the script runs it will pause and do nothing for 20 seconds. Now the reason I've put that in is so that when you plug the phone in it doesn't try to boot up immediately because the battery may not have enough charge to do that. So by sleeping for 20 seconds it has 20 seconds of charge which will be enough to power the phone on. And then system bin reboot is calling to run this reboot command which will power the phone on into its system state. So that's all there is to it. You can hit done. Um, as a note, I don't know if this is necessary. I changed the line termination to Unix terminators. And then I hit back, save, and now once it's saved, hit back again, long press on LPM, hit your three dots up here, hit properties, and then you note the permissions, owner, and group. This is what we're going to be changing. The permissions we need to change so that the owner has read, write, and execute. We also need to have read for group and other and execute for group and other. And click OK there. Now the owner is root, that's OK. The group needs to be changed to shell. So once that is done, we have rwx, r-x, r-x, root and shell. You can hit cancel, and that's all there is to it. If your phone is off or the battery is completely dead, when you plug it in, whether it's USB or wall, when you plug it in and it begins charging, it will automatically boot. Well, hopefully this helps some of you out. Um, as always, uh, if you enjoyed it, leave me a comment or uh, subscribe. Thanks for watching.